Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to transfer one Gmail account to another. So the ability to transfer all of your previous email to a new Gmail account uh, as well as contacts and other stuff from within your Gmail account. So go up to the settings of your current Gmail account, the little gear or cog icon, and then go to see all settings, which is the first option there. And then you want to click on the fourth tab, which is accounts and import. The option you want to select here is going to be import mail and contacts. You can see here you can import from Yahoo, Hotmail, AOL, or other webmail or POP3 accounts. So if it's a web or browser based email, service you'll be able to utilize this feature go to import mail and contacts and then this dialog box will come available to you here it'll say what account do you want to import from so if it's a gmail account which in the case of this tutorial it will be go ahead and type in that gmail account or username now once you've typed in that email address go ahead and click the continue button there below that dialog box it will then check that and if it is a gmail account it will then ask you to log into that account so go ahead and hit continue here and then another dialog box will come available to you here asking you to log in to that email address that you want to transfer from. So let's go ahead and click there to uh, go ahead and and once we click that it will go ahead and begin the what they call Gmail shuttle cloud migration. If we scroll to the bottom here we click the blue allow button then you just close that window to continue. It will then check and make sure that you've logged in and everything is kind of going the way that you want it to go and then you can check do you want to import contacts. Do you want to import the previous email? Do you want to import new mail for the next 30 days? Because that's something you can do as well. So check the different boxes here that you want to check. So if you want to import mail and email uh, and contacts, you can just check the first two boxes and then click the start import button. It'll take a few minutes to an hour depending on how many emails you have in that old account. And then when you're good to go, you just close out of this box. You will see and get a notification that it is completed. And if you want to see the progress of it, you go back into settings here. Go to see all settings. Go to accounts and import. You can see here I'm not actually going to import mine. But you'll see something here that say import in progress or import is completed. And then it will give you that email address that you imported from if you want to go back and do that there. Now, if you have any questions, please, if you would, put those in the comment section down below. If you like this video, if it helps you out, go ahead and help me out by liking, sharing, and subscribing for more great technology tutorials just like this, and I will see you guys in the next video.